And stronger winds, Joe, the winds. The winds, <laughs> the, the winds are going to be far worse tomorrow. So, uh, yeah, just hang in there. Sunday will be better, all right? As we look at conditions across the area, very windy on Saturday afternoon. We'll either be under a wind advisory or warning. We're looking for gusts of 55 miles an hour, areas of blowing dust. Where the winds come up, you'll probably want to get inside. Turning milder early next week, and then more rain and snow chances increase toward Wednesday. Here's what we're looking with the front side of that storm. Some rain and snow showers, bands rolling across, so not everybody got a good soaking rain, but some areas did. On the back side of the system, not only will there be some wraparound snow, but also strong winds out of the northwest mixing down into southeastern parts of New Mexico. So this area that you see in the light green winter storm, I should say high wind warnings for gusts to 65 miles an hour or higher southeastern parts of New Mexico up to 75 in the Guadalupe Mountains. Again, those uh, winds to 55 miles an hour from Albuquerque to the west that could uh, bring in a high wind watch could translate into a high wind warning or advisory and advisories for winds over 50 miles an hour over southwestern parts of New Mexico. Now this is just a snapshot of what could happen late afternoon. You see 40 50 mile per hour wind gusts pretty common, but in these darker shades, that's where it could easily gust over 65 miles an hour. And then most of the snow will be ending to the west tonight, but the snow will accumulate around the higher terrain 8 to 14 inches when all is said and done, especially above that 8500 foot level. So you can see with the projections, it's more these darker shades where the snow will be the heaviest, but be careful in Raton Pass. There could be some very dicey travel, hence that winter storm warning there. Okay, we'll be uh, quiet to start the day. Notice the breeze to start to come up around 10 o'clock in the morning. Impact weather for areas of blowing dust. When you get winds up to sustained around 31 miles an hour, that's when you can gust over 50 miles an hour. So that's the heads up we're giving you. Here's your statewide planner. There'll be snow and blowing snow across the northern mountains. We get to the noon hour. The winds are cranking across all of New Mexico. Blowing snow, dangerous travel at times throughout Raton. And that would be the case as we get into late in the afternoon as well. Now, when we get on into Sunday, it'll be breezy. We'll have more sunshine around and temperatures will be on the cool side, but uh, the breeze will be a whole lot more tolerable than what we're going to experience for tomorrow. Four Corners region forecast. It's going to be gust over 40 miles an hour throughout the Four Corners region and improving conditions Sunday, Monday and Tuesday. And there's that windy Wednesday system where we're looking for more rain and snow to work across the area. We'll be in the 50s tomorrow, southwestern parts of New Mexico, areas of blowing dust all throughout this region. It does improve for the latter portion of the weekend and more rain snow mixes working in to the Silver City area by Wednesday 50 well, 41 degrees. So it's going to be windy and uh, strong, potentially damaging winds from Ruidoso, Alamogordo, southeastern parts of New Mexico. So we could have winds gusting over 60 miles an hour and maybe up to around 50 miles an hour the following day. Not a good weekend in southeastern parts of New Mexico. The northern mountains will have the snow and blowing snow in the uh, higher terrain. So be careful on the ski slopes there and then that high wind warning with winds gusting up to around 50 miles an hour or so and the Las Vegas area with uh, more rain and snow showers clipping that area as we get to the middle of next week. A snow and blowing snow around the higher peaks and then blowing snow showers scattered in Santa Fe. Very brisk, 38 degrees and then 52 by Tuesday on into Wednesday. And the metro area checks out like this. Cold in the morning and then areas of blowing dust in the afternoon with gusts to 55 miles an hour. Impact afternoon that could keep you inside. Breezy but better on Sunday. A little warmer for Monday and rain chances start to pick up as we get into Wednesday and more of the isolated showers around by Thursday. So I know, Shelly, you didn't like the wind today. It's going to be far worse <laughs> tomorrow, so be prepared. Do not leave the house. Okay, I like that. Thank you, Joe.